In this tutorial, I am going to take you through the process of creating a photographic render of a whiskey glass, or beverage of your choice. While the series is aimed at people just getting into Moto's workflow, there will be plenty of tips and tricks along the way for users already up to speed in Moto. The training takes a hands-on approach, guiding you start to finish without any cuts in the creation of the scene. From looking up reference to final render, there are no breaks in the recording. Everything done to create the final render is recorded and discussed along the way. The goal is to show you many areas of Moto's tools and workflow. From starting with subdivision modeling, then touching on the sculpting tools, and even showing a bit of dynamics. Once the scene is built, I guide you through the process of creating materials from scratch, or using Moto's vast resource of material and environment presets. Much time is spent in Moto's shader tree, showing you all the necessary elements to create a realistic render. The final time is spent really refining the scene and adding all those final touches, such as reflection cards, lighting caustics, and realistic depth of field. Then we go through all the elements you will want for post-production of your render. Things like applying an alpha channel or other outputs for specific materials or items. There is even a bonus chapter on creating another render scene, discussing ways to quickly create a complex look and feel from the same base geometry. This really is a full tour of Moto in a project-based workflow. And I hope you come along for the ride.